It's early on a Monday morning, and we have some breaking news here on the San Francisco 49ers report by Chat Sports. I'm your host, Chase Senior. Hope all of your weeks are off to a great start. San Francisco has signed a former Pro Bowl safety. We'll get to that coming up. But first, today's show sponsored by LinkedIn Talent Solutions. You know what's pretty crazy about the growth here at Chat Sports? I started on March 1 last year. We had a total of seven employees, including me, so eight. Now we have 20. We wouldn't be able to grow like we've been able to grow without your support and also making quality hires. And that's where LinkedIn Talent Solutions comes in because all the job applications that do come in, we know that we are hiring and interviewing primetime candidates. So you can post your job for free by heading to linkedin.com slash NFL Daily. We'll tell you more about them coming up here in just a few moments. So some breaking news here on the 49ers report. According to Adam Schefter, the Niners have signed safety to Sean Gibson. He did play with the Chicago Bears last year. A little bit older at this point in his NFL career, but we're talking about an established veteran who's been in the league for a long time and has been very well accomplished. More insight on him. 32 years old. He played his college football at Wyoming. Went undrafted back in 2012, but he was able to find his footing early in his NFL career to the point where he's still playing about a decade later. Played with the Cleveland Browns from 2012 to 2015 with Cleveland. Made a Pro Bowl back in 2014, which is obviously a huge achievement for anybody who was a UDFA who had to carve out a roster spot in the National Football League from Cleveland. Went to the Jacksonville Jaguars where he played from 2016 to 2018. 18 and then signed consecutive one-year deals with the Chicago Bears in 2020 as well as 2021. Wasn't with the team this offseason, so up to this point was unsigned and a free agent because at this point there's some mileage on the tires. He's a little bit older. He also has versatility to his craft. He can play free safety where he's better positioned to have success, but if you need him in a pinch to play strong safety too, then he can also play the other safety spot and kind of range all across the field. Now, of note here is that tomorrow on Tuesday, rosters across the NFL have to get cut down to 80 players. The 49ers would not be signing Gibson if they weren't going to have him on this roster to cut him a day later. So at the very least, he's going to be here through this week into next week and maybe play in the final 49ers preseason game coming up on Thursday. Of course, we'll do a watch party for it. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. But on top of that, with the injury to Jimmy Ward, San Francisco is a little bit light in the secondary at that safety spot. So Gibson is an established veteran who at the very least is going to be a training camp body at the most, then maybe Gibson can come in, crack the 53-man roster, and give you some pretty solid safety depth for a guy who's had a lot of success in this league and has played for several NFL teams. Before we continue to break this down, want to hear from you in the comment section. Put your general manager hat on here, Faithful. Do you think that Gibson will make the 53-man roster? Give me a Y for yes, give me an N for no. Let me know right now in the comment section. Now, as of right now, after two preseason games with one preseason matchup still left to go and with the regular season coming up on September 11th, these are the four safeties that I think are going to make the roster no question about it. Jimmy Ward, who's just named a top 100 player in the National Football League. George Odom, Talanoa Hufanga, and Tarvarius Moore. Once the Niners trim down that roster to 53 players, I think they have two starters who I think are going to be Jimmy Ward and Talanoa Hufanga, but Ward, because of that hamstring injury, his status for week one and week two, somewhat in question. And then I expect them to have two backups, George Odom and Tarvarius Moore. Maybe they keep five, and if they do keep five, maybe that's where Gibson comes into play. Now, San Francisco is hiring Gibson. Gibson for at least this upcoming week. Today's show presented by LinkedIn Talent Solutions. As you gear up for the fall, you need the right place on your team and the right people on your team to help your small business fire on all cylinders like us here at Chat Sports. LinkedIn Jobs is here to make it easier to find people you want to talk to faster and get this for free as well. 
You can create a job post in minutes on LinkedIn Jobs to reach your network and beyond to the world's largest professional network of over 810 million people. Then add your job and the purple hashtag hiring frame to your LinkedIn profile to spread the word that you're hiring so your network can help you find the right people to hire. Simple tools like screening questions make it easy to focus on candidates with just the right skills and experience so that you can quickly prioritize who you'd like to interview and more importantly, hire. It's why small businesses rate LinkedIn Jobs number one in delivering quality hires versus leading competitors. LinkedIn Jobs helps you find the candidates you want to talk to faster. And did you know every week, nearly 40 million job seekers visit LinkedIn. You can post your job if you're an employer running a business for free at linkedin.com slash NFL daily. That's linkedin.com slash NFL daily to post your job for free. Terms and conditions do apply. And as I said, here at Chat Sports, we've been able to grow because of all of your support, all of your super chats, you guys subscribing, and also tuning into our shows. I started here. I was the eighth employee a year and a half ago already. 20 employees as we continue to take over the digital media world and give you the most entertaining and informative content we hire quality candidates thanks to linkedin talent solutions i'll put that link in the comment section and the description of this video back to gibson here so last year he was really just okay he played 12 games his most notable last season was 2020 in terms of his statistics and his production. Played all 16 games two years ago, had 66 tackles, seven pass breakups, and two interceptions. Those numbers, pretty good for a safety on a Bears defense that was pretty solid. So as I said a little bit earlier, I think at the very least, Gibson's going to be able to come in. He can master this defensive scheme very quickly if he's here beyond one week and at least be a camp body. At the very most, he can give you veteran safety help for a guy who knows his wits about in the National Football League and has gone up against a bunch of opposing offenses, has seen some of these schematic changes happen offensively and defensively. He's seen how this league has trended over the last decade, and he can give you that veteran leadership on the back end, especially if you're worried about Jimmy Ward maybe missing beyond one week or two weeks. You start off the season September 11th against the Chicago Bears, week two against the Seattle Seahawks. Week three is where it gets interesting. You go on the road to take on the nemesis and Russell Wilson, an offense that at the wide receiver spot, running back, tight end, they have a lot of really good weapons, and that's when you need these safeties. So if Ward is out for a long period of time, beyond that estimated one to two week slate to begin the regular season, this Gibson signing could become somewhat relevant for San Francisco's defense. And when you have the defensive line that the Niners have, it takes pressure off of the secondary for able to generate that pass rush like they were against the Minnesota Vikings with everybody chiming in from Charles Amenihu to Drake Jackson, Javon Kinlaw, and more. Now, Faithful, this is why you subscribe to the channel. And if you ain't subscribed, you ain't alive. When breaking news happens, we cover faster than anybody else. And we're not pushing out minute, two-minute videos, full analysis and player breakdowns of some of these signings. Also, we hit you with great analysis as well as all of the latest rumors, watch parties, live shows, live podcasts where you can call in on calling. We're doing it all. 61,233 people right now are subscribed to the 49ers report. We're going to try to get to 62K by the start of week one. So to round this show out, more insight on Tashawn Gibson. 32 years old, played his college ball at Wyoming, has had a lot of success in this league. Browns, Jags, Bears also played for a little while with the Houston Texans in that little bit of a gap between Jacksonville as well as Chicago. These really his most notable stops here. Pro Bowl back in 2014, wasn't with the team this offseason. Better as a free safety, can play strong safety too. We'll see if he has an opportunity to crack this roster as he is a little bit long in the tooth. If you made it this far, that means that you are a classified, bona fide, real one, and we greatly appreciate you for absorbing all of our content. If you made it this far, you're still kicking it with me, I want you to type real one, get your real one shirts today, and we'll check back later right here on the 49ers Report.